time now for Eyewitness News Call 12 for action. Thousands of cribs are being recalled for high levels of lead. And a major safety recall on thousands of baby gates. Consumer reporter Susan Hogan joins us now with the important information to keep your family safe. Think about it, everything goes into a toddler's mouth, including the rails on their crib. And now a major crib manufacturer is recalling thousands of cribs for violating the lead paint standard. Baby's Dream recalls cribs and furniture. The vintage gray paint on the cribs, furniture, and accessories exceeds federal lead limits. And if ingested, lead can cause adverse health effects. Now, the recall involves Baby's Dream full-size cribs and furniture sold under the Brie Braxton Heritage names. The recall includes furniture manufactured between March 2014 and March 2015 made in Chile. Now, consumers should immediately contact the company to arrange for and exchange. IKEA is recalling more than 70,000 pressure mounted safety gates. The friction between the wall and the pressure mounted safety gate is insufficient to hold the gate in its intended position, posing a fall hazard. In addition, the lower metal bar can be a tripping hazard. There have been 18 incidents worldwide, including three in which children have been injured as a result of falling down the stairs. Consumers should stop using the gates and return to IKEA for a full refund. And Lazy Boy is recalling its wall saver power reclining furniture due to a fall hazard. The power recline XRW when reclined can tip forward if the consumer exits without bringing the chair to an upright position posing a fall hazard. The company has already received five dealer reports of furniture tipping forward. Consumers should stop using the chair and contact the local dealer for a refund or repair. The recalled recliners were sold nationwide from January 2015 through March of 2015. We have a lot more information for you regarding these recalls and many others on our website right now at WPRI.com. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. I'm Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.